So obviously we've put together two different kinds of models here. We've put down a top-down model and we've put together a bottoms-up. Sometimes those models just don't link up. They miss each other. And um, what you need to do when that sort of uh, occurs is to go back and look at your assumptions. Um, something in there is wrong. And uh, oftentimes it's your market penetration assumption um, because those are usually um, the types of assumptions that are hardest to actually reference and footnote. Um, so generally what I find is if I tend to lean more towards the bottoms up market model because I believe that's what's real. Um, in our example, um, uh, the number of accounts that a, a person can physically cover is a limitation. And the number of cases that are actually done at each account is another limitation. And so I figure, I feel for me, that's a much more accurate um, uh, estimate of what sort of uh, business I can gain uh, compared to kind of looking at an overall patient population and slicing it by a percentage and then slicing that by another percentage. Um, so when in doubt, if you have to make a decision and your models are not lining up, I tend to look at the bottom-up market model as being a little bit more accurate than the top-down.